Hi, I'm Dr. Alexi from Innate Healthcare Institute. I'm a functional medicine physician and I specialize in autoimmune diseases and neuroimmunology. So today I wanna to talk a little bit about autoimmune disease, stem cell therapies, and what role stem cells play in overcoming the disease process of autoimmune disorder. So what is autoimmune disease? I think this is an important discussion because I want to give clarity to patients on what exactly it is, as there is some confusion in what the disease process is. So what autoimmune disease is, is it's when your own immune system attacks healthy tissue in your own body. This is known as a loss of immune tolerance. So that should not be happening. You should never be attacking your own tissue. And that shows that something has definitely disrupted your immune system and you need to figure that out. Now, it's pretty prevalent. About two to 5% of the world has an autoimmune disorder. In the US, that number is 20%. So about 20% of Americans are suffering from some type of an autoimmune disease and that number keeps growing. There's about 80 plus autoimmune conditions, and some of them you might have heard of, uh, MS, rheumatoid arthritis, eczema, Hashimoto's, so uh, multiple sclerosis is where your immune system is attacking your brain. RA, rheumatoid arthritis, is where your immune system is attacking your joints. Hashimoto's, thyroiditis, hypothyroidism, that is where your immune system is attacking your thyroid. Eczema or psoriasis, that's where your immune system is attacking your skin cells. But irrelevant of what the end organ or tissue is that is being attacked by your immune system, the end process is the same and the disease process is the same for all autoimmune diseases. Okay, so what causes autoimmune disease? This is a question I get a lot, and are there things that do cause autoimmune disease? And the answer is yes. So autoimmune disease is known as a lifestyle disease or an environmental disease. And some of the things that can cause it is environmental toxins, such as uh, plasticizers like phthalates, uh, BPA, you probably heard of BPA before. Those are xenoestrogens, so they mimic a very strong form of estrogen. Uh, then there's pesticides, insecticides like organophosphates and uh, organochlorides, which are incredibly neurotoxic, and they also dysregulate your immune system. Now, there's also a hormonal aspect. So if your hormones are imbalanced, uh, for example, your cortisol, your estrogen, progesterone, those are all helping to modulate your immune system. So if those are thrown off, you could have an immune system imbalance as well. And the last thing I wanna talk very briefly about that can cause autoimmune diseases is leaky gut syndrome or intestinal permeability. Now this is where the lining of your guts become damaged and it's become permeable in molecules of food, bacteria, bacteria endotoxins known as LPS, lipopolysaccharides, they can get out into your bloodstream and they trigger an immune response, a very strong one. Now, if you do that repeatedly enough, you will develop an autoimmune disorder. All right, so the other thing I wanted to talk about that I get a lot of questions on is, is it possible to re-regulate your immune system? And is it possible to cure this disease process? Well, yes and no. So you're never gonna be able to completely get rid of the autoimmune disease process, but you can re-regulate the immune response. So we put that in remission with natural methods. Now where stem cell therapy is very, very unique is that stem cell therapy not only helps to re-regulate and balance your immune system, but it has also been shown that it can build an entirely new immune system. So that makes it very unique in its therapeutic approaches, 
we don't have anything in our conventional medical model or in alternative complementary medicine medical models that can do this at this time. So it makes stem cell therapy very unique in that regard. So what we do at our clinic is we incorporate functional medicine to help re-regulate your immune system. So finding out what dysregulated your immune system is very, very important. So those are the three that I talked about. So the toxins, hormones, leaky gut, and other factors as well. So figuring out what has made your immune system go awry and why. And then we bring in the stem cell therapy to not just re-regulate your immune system, but also to help rebuild a brand new immune system for you. I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you for your time.